Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys. And today guys, I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to fix this error right here that you may get on Discord that says this interaction failed. So this is a common error that a lot of people get, so I'm going to go through a couple of steps that you can try and get rid of this error and fix it yourself. But yeah guys, make sure you watch this quick and easy video to the very end and follow my steps correctly. So you can make sure this works the same for you and that you can do this yourself. But yeah guys, let's get straight into it. The first thing you want to do guys is go ahead and open up the official Discord application if you haven't already. After opening it up guys and logging into your account, you will be greeted by this main page right here where you can see all the necessary info about your Discord application. Here you can see all of your servers, here you can see your friends and so on. So guys, now what we want to do, if you keep getting this error by sending a message or doing some else feature and you keep getting this error, then there are a couple of solutions that can fix this. If you look right here, there is a thread on Reddit that has the same exact problem. Some people have get shown what you can do in the comments to get rid of this error. As you can see, somebody said that after just starting uh, to wait a little, this error has gone. So sometimes, guys, you just have to wait a couple of hours and log in into your account again. After a couple of hours, the problem should fix itself. Sometimes the problem is just up to Discord servers. So you can always be sure uh, that it is up to you. But yeah, guys, sometimes it's just a problem with Discord. If this doesn't work, even after a couple of hours, you're still getting the problem, then what you can do is try updating the application. So you want to go here to the taskbar and right click on Discord and just click on check for updates to see if there are any updates that you can use right now to update your application and see if the problem is with your application being updated. So go ahead and update your application and wait a couple of hours and then this should probably fix your problem. If you still keep getting the problem, then what you can do is go ahead and contact the Discord support to ask them what the problem is so they can give you an answer how to fix it. But yeah guys, basically those are the options that you can try. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. So guys, thanks for watching, take care and bye.